Hello and we're back with the Dark Descent Amnesia. <gasps> oh, it's one of the bugs. Straight away there's going to be some nice uh, disturbing noises. So we, uh, uh, from last time, the, what was it? Story? Uh, yeah, from Algeria. They found some tomb to take back to the British Museum. And we have to find some stuff to destroy that weird pink stuff, like flesh. And I can't remember where we are, but yeah. That's why I just keep hearing footsteps. <laughs> uh, let's not waste it. Let's have a little candle. Oh, there's a bit of paper. Let's have a look. I hereby offer my full attention and service to Alexander, Baron of Brennenburg. This contract will reign for the total of three years when my freedom shall return to me. In addition, Alexander, Baron of Brennenburg, is to recommend my services at the Prussian Royal Court and within the sanctum of the Order of the Black Eagle. May no man break this seal. William, House of Garrick. Oh, let's move the chair. Yeah. Where did that go? No, oh, there it is. Some flint. Uh, tinder. Anything inside? Nope. I hope that was it for that room. How many do I actually have? Four. Let's go in here. What was that? I heard something. <coughs> oh crap. I remember he goes slightly mad in the darkness. Oh, 17th okay. of May, 1839. My hands tremble as I write. I feel a need to document my tribulation for I fear that my memory will fail me if I linger. No, oh, part two of the Today, Algeria. I took some men and oh. ventured into the dark, ancient passage we uncovered. Our torches burned faintly in the murky air as we slowly made our way underground. The men were superstitious and fearful. They argued loudly, and I felt their strange language getting to me. I mustered my strength and yelled at them to continue down the slopes and broken steps. The crudely carved passage confused me. It looked much older than the 4th century structure we had expected. The twisting path emerged into a great antechamber. The walls were lined with statues unlike any I'd ever seen. Despite their unearthly quality, I felt a strange familiarity toward them, which haunts me still. At the far end of the chamber, a great slab of stone sealed off whatever lay ahead. I gave the order to raise it, and as I pushed through the narrow space, <coughs> the heavy stone suddenly dropped, sealing me inside. I was trapped. Oh, pick up. Yep, yeah, got it. Let's, let's light this. <laughs> oh, let's have a look. Do I need oil? No, no oil. I'm gonna have to use the tinder boxes as I go then. Oh, what the hell? What the? 
Wow. Okay, I was not expecting that. <laughs> Light it, light it, light it, light it, light it. <laughs> I need oil. I know I heard some music as well, but I don't know if that's actual music or he's just hallucinating the music. It's time to go a bit mental. What is going on? Open the drawer. Nothing. Okay, I'm gonna run into there. Run, 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 run. <sighs> the light. The light is the savior. That's a big ass painting. This is actually actually say what it is. Oh. oh that's that corridor there. Um let's go straight to the end. I think I've come the wrong way but what the hell was that? I have a feeling it's gonna go mental in here. Is that oil? Quickly, quickly, quickly. Quickly. What was that? Oh, nothing. Oh, more nothings. <laughs> Even more. Hey. Can I not grab it? Oh no. Can I hit it with a helmet? Can I play a jaunty tune on it? Nope, I can't do anything with it. Great. Oh, I'm stuck. Jump over it. was trying to look through the gap. Oh. Okay, this is not breakable by hand, but I keep clicking it and it broke. It broke. Oh. You have to be swift when you activate the first one. You hear that? If it stops, you'll have to start over. Isn't all this a bit excessive? You can never be too careful, Daniel. Yeah, Daniel, you can never be too careful. Especially in a game like this. Alright, let's fill it up with oil. I'm gonna have a quick look back outside just in case I wanted to go in here. Yeah, oh, oh, okay. Get some paper. Let's check the drawer. Oh, there's the paper. Oh crap, really? Another one of his episodes. 17th of May, 1839. After pounding the unforgiving stone wall for what seemed like an eternity, I realized it was hopeless. I was trapped. I fell to the ground, gasping for air, trying to focus. That's when I saw a faint blue shimmer. My oh. weakened body was heavy to carry, but I managed to push myself toward the enchanting light. What is it? 
It was waiting for me. Oh. Enclosed what? in dark nothingness, I felt myself drawn to the mystic light. I it? reached out, <clears throat> closing it in my hands. The faint glow escaped my fingers and began to spark brightly and spirit me away. Unlocking alien memories of spiraling towers, endless deserts, and impossible geometry. The next thing I can remember is the grating sound of stone being lifted. The voices of the Arabs pulling me to safety. And grasped firmly in my hands was the broken pieces of a most peculiar relic. Oh, it was from in the Algeria. So he caught the relic, but it was broken. Okay, but what was the relic? So what was the uh, the point of it? I guess that's what we're gonna find out. Well, I hope so. Unless this is the reason for everything. Is the relic? I swear the piano was just playing. just tried to play it myself and nothing happened. Why does the ghost get to play it? I just got a memento. Oh, oh, okay. Was that it? Yeah. Okay, cool. So, straight into the place where it said that normal hands can't break. Or wherever it said. Let's go. I like how I've got this positive attitude of yeah, yeah let's go when we know there's gonna be some bad stuff that's gonna happen. How am I gonna break that? Let's just dash a book at it. The box. Hey. Okay, yeah, it's gonna okay, I'll read it, okay. Books are dead and the uh, Benenberg Castle 1801. Another region rich with lore is Altstead. Deep within the East Prussian woods, for centuries there have been stories surrounding the hamlet and its neighbour, Castle Brennenberg. The quiet forest clad mountains dressed with scattered lakes is as picturesque as it as can be. Albeit the area is haunted by the dark. Ask any local and you will hear you, yeah, you will hear proof of the widespread superstition. All travellers should indulge themselves in such conversations since it will certainly serve as exciting entertainment. All of them have their own twists on the tales, but there are some motifs that keep reappearing. Ooh, spooky, spooky. <laughs> this story reaches... Oh wait, the gatherers. This story reaches all the way back to the time of the Thirty Years' War. It is said that the soldiers who abandoned their duty got lost in the cold dark woods and were forever damned to roam the grounds. Their bodies ruled by the tainted souls have left them disfigured and empty of essence. Many have cited them over the years and described them as horrid revenants. They move silently through the woods, shying away from any beholder. They are called gatherers as they seem to follow some ambition to steal living creatures. Steal living creatures? Okay, that's a bit weird. So it's gonna be like, see if a squirrel or something, and it's gonna be like, I'm having that. <laughs> it is their prey which can be heard struggling inside damp burlap sacks, dragged behind them, which reveal their presence. What dark scheme do they follow? Uh, the visit undone. Henrik Cornelius Agrippa. The well-known erudite visited Altstad at the start of the 16th century. He resided in the local inn for a fortnight as he looked for remnants of kingdoms past. During his stay, all the prominent members of society paid notice and he is mentioned in many records of the time. One day he went to investigate a burrow in the northern, northwestern glades only to never be seen again. Henrik is known to have passed away in Grenoble 
some ten years later. Okay, I heard a noise. I had, I had to turn around. <laughs> <laughs> he dim he dismissed the notion of ever visiting Ulstead, which makes you wonder what really happened. Who was this mysterious man who visited the sleepy hamlet in the woods, and what happened to him? Maybe it was someone just claiming to be him, and they thought, oh, it's that guy. Mistaken identity, or is it something more sinister? Maybe he went and then the memory got wiped. Or it was too horrific, so his mind built a barrier around what happened. The immortal Baron. The Baron of Brennenberg lives as a reclusive life, with his family at his castle nearby Ulstead. And like most of those of noble birth, rumours are inherited alongside with the title. Researching the history reveals little before the castle was consumed by fire in the late 16th century. It was rebuilt by Alexander. A noble woman from the Rhinelands claiming the role as protector of the Russian state. Oh, sorry, Prussian state. Alexander helped the reign to flourish and remain popular throughout his presumed lifetime. The family has always been secretive when it comes to lineage and heritage. Therefore, the birth and death of Alexander and his offspring has never been fully recorded. This has fed the idea that the Baron is in fact the one and the same who came from the West over 300 years ago. Ooh, some sort of vampire. <laughs> <coughs> Lived through the time of occupation and joined the coveted order of the Black Eagle, along with the great leaders of this country. So then is... This Alexander, the one that I'm supposed to be going after and to kill, or oh, that's way too dark. I believe that's correct. Uh, note to self. Yeah, find Alexander and kill him. So maybe he's the same guy. Oh, it's locked. Is there a key inside? Let's have to move everything. Maybe find a key or something. Oh, what's that? Is that a fake book? I don't know, I just saw it sort of. Is it open now? No. Cash okay, really weird how they're all making this really weird noise. Uh, is there any, any, any more? Ah, yeah, there's one more there. Oh, making this god awful clicking noise. No way, how did that run out so quickly? Come on, come on, come on. Is there another one? actually expecting it to open that door there, not actually to open another secret room. This game will be secret rooms and secrets of secrets and stuff. <laughs> oh, let's go and have a look at that painting. Oh, cool. What am I standing on? Did I just step on this spiderweb? It's a very, very strong spiderweb. There's the key. Holy shit. <laughs> Protect me, chair. Oh, I can't. Oh, yeah, I want the chuck. Let's have a look if there's any. Oh, paper. 
<coughs> ah. Will Helm and his fools have endangered my research long enough with my absent minded handling of the human vessels? The human vessels. The sheriff is keeping a watch while on the forest and is killing my trusty servants. It's just a matter of time until they follow the child to Brennenburg. I need to lock Wilhelm and his men up to avoid further investigation from the public. The wine cellar will therefore be sealed off until the matter has been handled. Either the king's men leave or they will starve. Whatever comes first. They can rot for all I care. Maybe I'll feed them some wine. It would in, se in, in a sense solve both of the problems. Both of my problems. Wow, okay. human vessels so is he experimenting on people oh it actually opened the door oh it's here okay uh, I guess we've got to go back okay oh, I actually don't remember the way up <gasps> what? What? What was that? Why? Why? That noise as well. Oh my god. Uh, I think I have to go back that way, don't I? Alright, Jay. Defend me. Oh my god, where did that come from? Alright, I'm gonna patrol the area. Oh, I'm gonna have to use this and I. thing it was done the man said the tomb had been revealed tin hinnan awaits grinned the toothless for foreman what 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 is going on why oh it's this stuff it's spreading why is it spreading what 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 turned around from being a spooky mystery to some sort of extra hellish game <laughs> I think I have to go oh is it there? I think ok bye now oh he needs start to go psycho otherwise is this the door oh uh, I have to actually use the key there we go we got some sort of relief from that a handful full of sand that trickled from the crumbling stone ceiling pushed down on the prime on the brim of his hat he braced himself as the cavern suddenly shifted and settled Wow, this game has slowly changed some intent. Oh my god. I know, I keep, I'm, I'm mumbling now, I know. <laughs> I thought, oh my god, sh shut up! <laughs> oh, great. Where did the Baron go? Who cares? He left a bit of oh, wine to last us a lifetime! Or at least until tomorrow! <laughs> Can I light it? Oh, thank goodness for that. <gasps> what? 
Why did that door shut on its own? What is this? Oh, it's a tool. I ran out of wheel. I don't think I have any more, do I? Oh, this is part of the... Huh? What's that? Too? Oh, tinder boxes. I've only got two left. Oh, great. Uh, barrels. <laughs> oh, I can't break them. I think I just got to search around. Come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. What I need. Oh, what? Why? 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 Oh my god. <gasps> Why did it have to blow everything out? Now I have to use the tinder. Oh no! What? Oh, that, that, that was it. His sanity is going, his sanity is going. Oh, come on. Huh? See, I don't know if there's something outside now, or it's just his hallucination has gone mental. Wait, does that mean I can combine or no? <coughs> oh, I didn't really want to do that. Okay, let's go in here. Why? Okay, I'm gonna open it. Because <laughs> it's trying to deter me from going inside. Turn the light Oh, it's me creaking. Well, I hope it's me. What's the? What's happening? Oh, it feels like my chest is going to burst. Oh. He's poisoned you. Oh, you my turned. God, it. Him, do something. Let's go shoot him. Except it. we're not getting out of here. How can you say that? Alexander, you piece of shit! Let us out of here! <laughs> so you poisoned it. Or put that acid stuff in it. There we go. No! <laughs> It's not what I'm looking for. I wanted that. Well, it is, but. I wanted that oil. Uh. <coughs> my name is Wilhelm, House of Garrick. These are my final words, my confession and testament. Two years ago, I was summoned to the castle of Brennenburg. As, mo as most of it. Oh, it's that fucking word again. Aristoc aristocracy. There we go. I was curious about this supposed Knight of the Order could want. Oh yeah, 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 that makes sense. yeah. Could one for me and accept the invitation? The Baron was friendly and offered me a proposition. It dawned on me that the nature of the contract was sordid, and the reason why I was chosen was because of the follies of my past, and not the honours. I have been rewarded with during my time as a soldier. I was to kidnap healthy humans upon his slightest whim. 
and do so without asking questions. Oh, there must have been the people there who thought about um, uh, the stealing of creatures. And I said about the scribbles, uh, this must be these people. In return, he would attest to my character at the royal court, advancing my position within noble society. I would like to claim that I struggled with my decision, but it came swiftly and I accepted wholeheartedly. Ever since that day, I brought men, women, and, and children to Brennenburg. I can't remember the numbers, but there were many, perhaps even a hundred, none of whom were ever seen or heard from again. Tonight, the Baron invited me and my men down to the wine cellar to celebrate our work. I had my suspicions as we descended the stairs. There, descended the stairs, but he insisted and joined us in a toast. The wine tasted fine, and my men drank without restraint. So begins the punishment of our sins. The Baron has locked us up and returned upstairs. Forgive me for what I have done. I was weak and fell into the, his diabolic ways. My men are screaming. Their skin have been pierced by their own tangled bones. Wow, okay. I feel my insides revolt against their God-given nature. Blood has become to pour from my eyes and I can no longer Wow, okay. Okay, so it, it, it's not the acid drink then. <laughs> it's something even worse. Maybe one of his experiments. Maybe that's what those, that thing was. It was one of them twisted into whatever it was. Oh, great. Yay. Oh, God, I actually, I actually didn't actually get any more, did I? Oh, God, the wailing. I guess I'm moving around with keys. <laughs> oh, chains. What's that? Is that it? Okay, let's. I believe that's a. Oh, there's two more rooms to check. Okay, I can't go in there. I've got to go through quick. enemy isn't it? What are you saying? So if I stay in the light it should be okay. Why is it only just now saying about the enemy? So does that mean there's someone nearby? What the hell? What was that? Oh, it's just a bit of rock. Oh, it's just... That's in the box. Okay, pick it up, pick it up. Oh, there we go. That's why I can open it. Okay. okay. Is that, a, is that a, please be fuel? Please be fuel. Nope. I believe it's the last one. So, do I... How do I combine it then? Oh, do I have to go back to the laboratory to do it?
Okay, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> it became impossible to avoid the commotion of the streets begged for his attention. As he opened the shutters, the French soldiers opened fire on the two young men fighting back. Their voices were silenced in the haze of gun smoke. Oh, great. Oh, it's spreading. Oh, crap. So, do I need to go back to the laboratory? Or do I just go straight downstairs? Okay, let's try to go downstairs and then just dash at it. Ow. <laughs> Screaming, yay! <laughs> so it must have been over here. That will just run to it. Please be all. Oh no. One day I'll return, it wasn't for the fault of you, my love, I won't be able to go on. When I find myself doing terrible things, I, I take comfort in you. As long as I'm able to think of you and long for a life together, I know I'm better than others. I weep for them, they lust for power without restraint, where I only crave their judgement and safe return. Wait, what is that, then? Can I not take it? So much. So he's just gonna keep doing that. Okay, fine. So Okay, I'm stuck now. <laughs> I've got the four. No, I won't do that. But why? Okay, I'm gonna end the episode there until I figure out what I've got to do. <laughs> Sorry about that, but yeah, it's gonna drive me nuts. Okay. Places. <laughs> <laughs>